Has this ever happened to you? Not your naive citizen. I have the perfect solution for you. No way! Introducing the ultimate guide for holding open the door for complete strangers. Now, you may think, oh, handsome, wonderful, luxurious Joseph, how could there possibly be such a comprehensive guide to something so utterly mundane as holding open a door? Well, fret not, you don't want to be like this guy. No, I didn't think so. Now, look at this graphic. <laughs> you know, every time I look at it, it makes me laughing. Here you have a simple door holding scenario. The distance between the door holder and the stranger can be broken down into three simple different zones. One, the safe zone. In this zone, you can clearly partake in the fluid motion of holding open the door without having to wait too long for the other person to pass through the door. Wow, just look at that form. Number two. We have the caution zone. This zone is a tricky one because it's right on the edge of the safe zone, but not quite close enough to hold the door without waiting for too long like a socially awkward penguin. But at the same time, it's not far enough to just close the door on the person right behind you. By the time the door fully closes, this stranger will be right at the foot of the door and will be forced to open it again for themselves. How dare you subject them to that torment, you ignorant fool! Luckily, there are ways to combat this issue if you find your stranger in the caution zone. The key is to slow down your door opening routine in order to cut down your TWD, and for layman's terms, that's your total waiting time. There's the no rush approach. Simply cut your total momentum or movement speed down about 10 to 20%. And there's the, oh, I got a text message approach. But let's be honest, you didn't. So you just pretend that you have and this stranger doesn't know you have no friends like I do. <laughs> just whatever you do, do not try the fake phone call. They'll see right through it. You may also think, to try the shoe tying method. Big mistake. The stranger knows your mother tied your shoes before you even got there. The key is to be subtle. If you can slow your roll without being too conspicuous, you will be just fine. Just smile and wave. Smile and wave. And finally, there's the dreaded danger zone. This zone is found past the caution zone. This is the most feared scenario yet. You're at the door and the stranger is too far for you to hold the door for them, but you're still close enough for them to acknowledge that you did not hold the door open for them. And to a stranger not privy to this comprehensive guide, they may feel insulted that you neglected the common courtesy of holding open the door for them. In this scenario, it's important to run. Abandon ship, abort mission. Damn it, under no circumstances do you hold open that door. And under no circumstances do you get caught not holding open that door. This method is the opposite of the caution zone. Instead of slowing your roll, you have to crank those rolls up to 11. It's okay, you're in a hurry. You speed up your motion and you get to that door and once inside, you just keep moving until you are out of sight of the stranger once they enter that door. 
Having done this, you cause the stranger to reconsider. Oh, maybe I was too far away for them to hold open the door. Maybe they're not so bad after all. But there is one issue that is overlooked in the danger zone, and that's the door itself. The last factor to consider is DCS, door closing speed for you morons out there. You must be sure that the door makes a complete close before the stranger arrives, preferably something uh, several seconds before they arrive. Neglecting this factor, you risk slamming the door into an unsuspecting pedestrian's face. Then no more apple pie for you. The solution, closing that door quickly behind you. Make sure there is no chance of it even being slightly open before the stranger gets there. Do this and you pocket the danger zone, you get your pie and you collect $200 from Go. But that's not all. This is only a glimpse as to what the entire guide details. For only $199.99, you can have the complete guide for door holding, which includes unique scenarios for holding the door for the elderly, veterans, your crush, your nemesis, your boss, your boss's nemesis, goldfish, dogs, cats, bank robbers, the president, Karens and zoologists, Susans and zoologists, Everyone in between with that Technicolor rainbow. I know who you are and you know who you should be. So call that number now and get this book. I'm out. Thank you very much for watching this guide on how to properly hold open doors. If you like this new format, make sure to leave comments below. Or just like and follow us and subscribe and all of that. Welcome to 2020 where things are going to be different and changed but at the same time the same old same old. You know the truth at this point. Just come join us. We'll see you soon. And don't forget to hold open the door for random strangers. <laughs> Except if they're in the, the, the except if they're in the danger zone. That that that, that don't then don't.